I curse a lot, actually. Yeah, I admit that I I, I curse um I curse a good amount. It's wrong, but you know it's hard it's hard to not. Not really. I'm. I don't really think that's very appropriate. I don't really curse that much. If I do, it would be maybe once every once in a while. I curse a lot and just with my friends and when I'm mad and stuff. I curse a lot just talking like regularly. I don't usually curse very often and maybe once or twice will slip. No, not that often. Just sometimes when I hurt myself. Usually when I'm just kind of mad and upset. Yes, I curse a lot. Um, not when I'm around old, my elders or anything, but in school I'll curse. Yeah, I do curse a lot, like, daily, I guess. <laughs> Once in a while, like, if I'm mad at something or, like, if I'm hyped about something. I try not to curse, uh, in fact, a couple days ago my dad caught me cursing a text message and I've tried to quit it that since then. What about your friends and about their cursing? They curse a lot, too. <laughs> behind their parents' back. Like, no no, no one I know does it in front of their parents. So. Yeah, my friends curse. Yeah, me and my friends just curse like when we're just having a conversation. Not in, an incredible amount, but they, we all try and curb our language because we all go to a Catholic school. And yeah, they curse, but like, I, they don't do it as much because I stopped. Not my close ones, not really, but you know, just kind of my friends that I sometimes hang out with, they curse every once in a while. My friends curse a lot, I guess you could say, but uh, I mean, it's situational. You know, if we're in school and stuff like that, there's no reason to curse and we won't curse. There are over 600,000 words in the English language. And still, some people choose to use profanity. Some of us curse in an effort to sound mature. While others do it to fit in with the crowd. And some of us don't even realize we're cursing. Today, we'll explore how young people use profanity and see what the scriptures say about the use of foul language. Hi, everyone. I'm Jess. And I'm Kenny. And, and this, this is, is Real Faith, Faith TV. TV. Many on the teens on the street have confessed to being guilty of swearing and using profane language. We'll hear from them more a little later in the show, as well as meet our studio guests. But first, let's meet our spotlight guest, Nina, who will tell us why she regrets getting caught up in the pattern of cursing. And why she thinks many young people also pick up this habit. I tend to curse when I'm like around my friends a lot, but I'm trying to stop. Most of my friends curse, some of them curse a lot, like, an excessive amount and some of them not that much. I find myself using profanity like when I'm really mad at someone or sometimes when I'm just hanging out with my friends and just like joking around and stuff. I think people curse because when they get mad it's like the first thing that comes to their mind most of the time. Their friends do it and probably they get it from their parents or other people they're around. I guess Kids usually use it because they try to act cool in front of their friends. It's become a social thing when people curse because they say it around their friends and they don't realize that they're actually cursing. And when they do curse, they don't mean it, they just say it because it's a way to fit in. So you start cursing and then like after a while it just turns into a huge habit and you just can't stop. I don't think teenagers should curse because it actually like degrades them and it doesn't show that they're mature, it just shows that they're still immature and they need to start respecting people more. From experience, I've done it and I know like I regret it because since it's become such a big habit, it's just like I just want to stop already. So I uh, like just take my advice and just stop while you're ahead. Yeah, like I definitely agree with what Nina was saying. Like I do curse, my friends curse. Like it's just kind of like it, it happens, you know, and it's definitely not like the right thing to do. But like, you get caught up like with your friends or whatever, so it does happen. Yeah, exactly. Like she said, it was a social thing. I totally agree with that. Yeah. Well, let's meet our studio guests and see if they struggle with the use of profane language. Okay, they are Mary, Vince, Phil, Ujama, Tiffany, Kelly, and Charlotte. So do any of you curse or did you used to curse when you were younger? I think I cursed a lot more when I was younger than now. I mean, I still do curse more than I should, but I try to be more aware of it, and I, I'll tell myself, Mary, that's not the right thing to do. Let's pick another word. I agree with Mary. Like, when I was younger, I would curse more, but as like now that I'm older, I like know that I shouldn't curse because it's bad. So. I kind of curse subconsciously. Like, there'll be times <laughs> where I'll be talking and like I'll slip a word in there, 
and people will be like, why'd you say that? I was like, what I say? I've started using substitution words and that's becoming more subconscious and regular cursing. So it's kind of good, but kind of bad because people know what I mean. I think I curse more now than I did when I was younger. I think it's different for me. I actually didn't curse when I was younger. I curse more now. You know, I try a lot not to. Actually, I'm the same. Well, when I was younger, it was more of a, I was a quiet child who didn't curse and then all my friends would something, maybe I should start, which looking back on it, I'm thinking, wrong decision, but you know, now it's, it's definitely trying to wean myself off of it. Often people swear when they are angry or frustrated. Others may curse because they hear it so often in the people around them that it seems a natural way to express themselves. Next, let's see in what situations the teens on the street say they use profanity. And why they think young people curse. Check it out. In what situations do you find yourself being most profane? Um, I guess I'm around my friends because, you know, you try to, try to outdo each other. Competitions and games. In school, when somebody tries to start with me or something, that's when I'll start to curse a lot. Well, I curse, like, a lot, repetitively, like, when I'm really mad. When I'm mad or I hurt myself. When I'm mad, mostly, like, really aggravated. When I'm mad, if I hurt myself. I find myself using profanity a lot when I'm like irritated by people. Even if I'm not mad or anything, I just say it just to express myself, I guess. Why do you think people curse? Um, I guess because they, so they it sounds cool and they just want to get attention. I think the curse is like they want to be cool. Because they think it sounds cool. Because they want to express their feelings. I think a lot of people do it to be cool. Um, I think it like makes a point more bold when people are talking. They think they sound cool or grown up and I, some people just because they hear it a lot they're used to us saying it. You grow up around it like you're always talking oh, not to say that word and when you're with your friends oh someone says it then like I don't know it just spreads out. I think they find a need to express themselves in an extreme matter. Because it's a way to let out anger and hurt other people. Uh, I think it's like definitely a part of our uh, society, you know, like, if there's a reason that people curse. Maybe they can't get the words out right, I guess, and they don't know what to say about something, so they just use any word. I remember being young and not cursing, but then you get older and you curse a lot just because it's kind of like, you feel like you fit in more, you become more of like an alpha, alpha male crowd or something like that. I think it actually becomes like a habit. <laughs> like, after you like learn the words, they just like come part of your like vocabulary. <laughs> I think one of the biggest reasons why people curse is because of, you know, how the media, how the media is voicing their opinions nowadays. Like you hear stuff like in music and movies and it's, it's constant hearing these curse words and we see people on TV and people we respect and idolize say negative things like that and we think that it's okay. Yeah, definitely. I think like you see celebrities like do it, you're like, all right, well they're doing it. You know, that's like obviously the cool thing to do, so let me try it, but it's totally opposite. Next. Let's see why Nina thinks young people curse. We'll hear about a time when Nina heard her mother using profane language, and that caused her to realize that she needed to break this habit. 